Hey, what's going on guys? Kevin back with another video here. So I know it's been a while. I haven't really made any videos with my training recently, but I thought I'll give you guys a little update on my training in the past month as well. A little Movember stash going on. I do want to start off the video saying I am doing an online powerlifting competition, the Calgary Barbell Virtual Meet 2020. So that's in November 28th. So about the time of shooting this video, it's a little bit more than three weeks out. So with that in mind, the anticipation of this meet coming on in a few weeks. So maybe about a month ago, I took some heavy singles. So the idea is you're a couple months out from competition. You've done all that volume and it's time to taper just a bit and see where your strength lies at. Starting off with the squat, hit 250 kilos, which is 551 pounds for a really nice single. I'm very, very happy how this 551 moved. It's probably the best I've ever moved 551. So this is a really good indicator my squats would be moving really well. That maybe 600, 600 plus is in the bank. We'll see about that. Next for the bench press, I benched 152.5 kilos, which is about 336 pounds. It moved okay. That's all I'm gonna say, it moved okay. The issue with my bench press is that when, I, when I'm at a heavier weight, it's not that the bench is hard per se, it's that my lower back actually like, not spasms, but tightens up through the range of motion. So you kind of see, it's kind of nice off the chest. Then it comes to sticking point. At that sticking point, my lower back, you know, gets tightened up and then I kind of fight through it and then, it, then I lock out. So that's something I'm trying to work on in my bench press is not to kind of arch my lower back, but trying to arch my upper back, if that makes sense. Lastly, I took 280 kilos. That is 617 pounds for my deadlift. This is actually a PR. It's a two and a half kilo PR. My best deadlift before was at Nationals, 612 pounds. And I took this just for a little chip, a little five pound PR. It was a little shaky on the lockout, but overall, again, I'm very happy. I, I moved 250 kilos on the squat nicely. I benched something nice and I deadlifted a PR all in one day. I'm feeling really happy. So something more recently I've incorporated in my training is slingshot bench press. So with slingshot bench, obviously A, you can overload the bench press, so you can move heavier loads, and B, it kind of helps you with your bench press technique. So in the past, when I bench press, I come in, I kind of over tuck off the chest, my elbows flare. So with the slingshot, it actually kind of helps me keep my elbows out, and then when I press, it kind of keeps the elbows in the same position. At the start, my bench felt a little weaker, it felt a little weird, but as the weeks are going on, um, my bench feels a lot better now. It does actually activate a little bit more shoulders because, you know, I got weak shoulders, but everything is feeling pretty good. And of course, last week was Halloween, so I dressed up as Scorpion from Mortal Kombat. If you guys are too young for this, ah, Mortal Kombat was an amazing game growing up. I used to play it all the time. And Scorpion was one of the best characters with the, get over here, like, <laughs> oh, it's so good. So I did some bench press in my costume. My buddy Derek dressed up as someone from the Peaky Blinders. Then I did some light deadlifts, I believe this is 520-ish pounds, and it moved pretty well. So that's really it guys, my training has been going pretty well, pretty consistent, I'm, I'm moving the way as I should, three, a little bit more than three weeks out from a competition, so I'm getting really excited with that. I'll be making videos about each week coming up to the competition, so you guys see how my training kind of progresses, how kind of volume decreases over the week, and how I'm just taking more of heavy singles and more specificity. And remember guys, if you haven't, please subscribe, hit that subscribe button, and yeah, see you guys in the next video, peace.